Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. If you're looking for the EG4 Brock Mount ground mount rack at Signature Solar, you might have noticed it's no longer in stock. And that got me curious. So I started digging into what happened, and I thought I'd share with you what I found out. Now, if you've been following the solar scene for a while, you probably remember the original Bright Mount kit. It was a revolution in DIY ground mount systems, affordable, DIY friendly, easy to ship, and simple to assemble. It quickly became a bestseller at Signature Solar and with other retailers as well. But here's the deal. Over time, the original overseas manufacturer had trouble keeping up with demand. And eventually they pulled the plug and stopped making it all together, which is why you saw it vanish from shelves back in 2024. To fill the gap, EG4 found a new manufacturer and rolled out what they call the Bright Mount Cat 1. It was a full redesign with new rails, bases, legs, and arms. And while it was easier to assemble thanks to some partial pre-assembly, it also came with a higher price tag. And that's mainly due to the rising shipping costs and ongoing supply chain headaches. They also offered a Cat 1 extension kit just like the original Bright Mount kit. And that would fit panels over 44 inches wide so you could get four on a, on a rack. And once again, demand was strong, but maybe too strong. The new manufacturer struggled to keep up just like the last one. But here's where things took a turn. Customer feedback started rolling in, and a lot of folks weren't as thrilled with the Cat 1. Now, I've used both versions myself, and I've got to agree, the original had a sturdier design with beefier square tube aluminum arms and a more solid mounting base. The Cat 1 gets the job done, but it didn't quite measure up to the original bright mount. So, based on that feedback, and the same old manufacturing issues, EG4 has now stopped production of the Cat 1 Bright Mount kit. The good news is they're working on a third generation version, aiming to bring back the durability and design quality of the original, while keeping it affordable for DIYers like us. You can still find some Cat 1 kits floating around at other retailers, but once those are gone, we'll be waiting on the next version. In the meantime, your current ground mount options from Signature Solar include the Integra Rack, the Power Fuel Power Rack, and the Chico USA ground flux. Now, fair warning, some of those ground mount systems are on back order due to the recent surge in solar demand, but all of them are still relatively DIY friendly and budget conscious compared to your professional installs. If you're looking for something that installs quickly and easily, the Integra rack is probably your best bet. It's similar in design to the bright mount, but about 40% more expensive. Now that said, it comes with more options for ballasting and anchoring and it goes together faster, so you pay a little bit more for the convenience with the Integra Rack. The Power Field Power Rack is a simpler system overall, less permanent, and the panels sit closer to the ground, but still a solid choice depending upon your setup and budget. Personally, I've had great success with the original Bright Mount, and I'm really hoping the new version lives up to the legacy. EG4 seems committed to wait until they can get this right, and I'm excited to see what they come up with next. In the meantime, don't forget, there are still plenty of DIY ground mount alternatives. I built one myself last year and it's worked out great. So check out this video, it's linked in the card above if you want to see how we did that build. It worked out great, I've got 12 panels mounted on it, and it's still running fine today. Even though most home solar setups still go on top of rooftops, there are a lot of us who prefer ground mount. You're not limited by roof space and it's way easier to access for maintenance. Hey, before I wrap up, I just want to say thank you to everyone who's used my Signature Solar discount code lately. That $50 off of every $500 order helps you save money and it helps support the channel because it lets us keep testing and reviewing new solar and battery gear for folks like you. Now, if you're still planning to install a DIY solar setup, just a heads up. The 30% federal solar tax credit is set to expire at the end of 2025. Now there's still time to get your system in and take advantage of that, but with demand through the roof lately, inventories are starting to tighten up. So don't wait too long if you're planning to build this year. Hey, got questions or have your own experience with a Bright Mount kit? Hey, drop them in the comments. I'll do my best to get you a solid answer. And remember, Signature Solar offers full tech support for all EG4 gear. So with a phone call or email, you're never really alone with your solar bill. I'm Michael and here at Terry Hill Farm, we're living two steps from off grid working every day to get that to zero. Thanks so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that subscribe button so you don't miss what's coming up next. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks.